Yeah, buddy. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Childish. We're back at it again with the next event update. Y'all know what it is. It's time to get it done here. So we got ourselves the Burning Time event, one of my favorite events, uh, free double XP. I uh, got to take advantage of this because uh, it's hard to get those units leveled up. And why not take the opportunity out of your time over the weekend to get the job done and level up these quickly? In addition, as you can see, we do have the double mana stones. So for those that are looking for a little bit of mana, want to get it done. Um, these are going to be done at certain times. As you can see, we got 8 to 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time and then 12 p.m. to 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time now. Um, because it is uh, Sunday, October 31st, it is Halloween, we have a second way of building that mana as well. If you don't have the opportunity to catch the double XP, please make sure you go ahead and head on down over to the secret dungeon. As you can see right here, we have ourselves the Wind Frankenstein. Um, one of the new units out of the two, the Frankenstein of the Jack-O-Lantern, um, you know, able to get that unit and, and play around with it. So again, um, for those that haven't uh, checked out my previous um, event updates when it comes to secret dungeons, definitely one to take advantage of when it's available. Um, it is a good source of income and it is a great source of fodder if you need it. You know, uh, there has been a little bit of controversy. What's the best way to go? Whether it's, uh, you know, farming the secret dungeons or farming like Bymon Hell or something like that. But at the end of the day, it comes down to, uh, you know, taking a look at the unit at hand and seeing what you can go ahead and do as far as, you know, planning for the future and upgrading it. If you guys remember, uh, for those that have been following my channel for quite some time, we did have ourselves a um, secret dungeon event uh, that was going on with the fire, uh, I think it was uh, Death Knight? Uh, fire Correction, I'm sorry. The Living Armor? Living Armor, Living Armor, yeah. So um, the Living Armor was going on and we had ourselves the opportunity to collect it you know a lot of people some people got up and not a lot of people did it and then they found out that the wind living armor was the uh one of the tried and true uh, units out there that really can get the job done if you level it out max it out and uh you know test it out so definitely um the wind frankenstein is going to be offered this time who knows when it's going to be offered next time so uh with the meta always changing it's always a great opportunity to collect these units whenever you can um, I'm definitely going to farm about, you know, 12 to 13 pieces so that if I ever get a light and dark one or any of the other ones change over the course of the time, as you guys know, com to us does uh, make some updates, some buffs, some nerfs, but hopefully buffs, right? We want to take advantage of that as well. So uh, make sure you all tune in and get that, okay? Um, I think that's going to be it, guys. Thank you all for tuning in. It's a pleasure to make these videos for you, as always. It's your boy Childish with Childish Plays checking out. Take care. We'll see you next time, guys. We're out.